Saren's hiding something. Give me more time. <gasps> Garrus! Stall the council. Don't be ridiculous. Your investigation is over, Garrus. Commander Shepard, Garrus Vakarian. I was the officer in charge of the CSEC investigation into Saren. Who was that? Who were you just talking to? That was Executor Palin, head of Citadel Security, my boss. He'll be presenting my findings on Saren to the council. Oops. Do you know my Saren? Sounds like you really want to bring him down. I don't trust him. Something about him rubs me the wrong way. But he's a specter. Everything he touches is classified. <clears throat> I think the council's ready for us, Commander. Good luck, Shepard. Maybe they'll listen to you. You don't want to keep the council waiting. Oh, Garrus. I'm immediately dropping him. I might have Caden and Garrus for a while, and then maybe the Krogan. I forgot who it is. Is it Grunt in this one, or is it... Um... No, it's Rex, isn't it? It's Rex, it's Rex. Hello there. I like how pretty this looks. Anderson. The hearing's already started. Come on. The Geth attack is a matter of some concern, but there is nothing to indicate Saren was involved in any way. The investigation by Citadel witnesses. Security turned up no evidence to support your charge of treason. An eyewitness saw him kill Nihilus in cold blood. We've read the Eden Prime reports, Ambassador. The testimony of one traumatized dock worker is hardly compelling proof. I resent these accusations. Nihilus was a fellow specter and a friend. That just let you catch him off guard. Captain Anderson, you always seem to be involved when humanity makes false charges against me. And this must be your protege, Commander Shepard. The one who let the beacon get destroyed. mission to Eden Prime was top secret. The only way you could know about the beacon was if you were there. With Nihilus gone, his files passed on to me. I read the Eden Prime report. I was unimpressed. But what can you expect from a human? Hmm. Saren despises humanity. That's why he attacked Eden Prime. Yeah. Your species needs to learn its place, Shepard. You're not ready to join the Council. You're not even ready to join the Spectres. He has no right to say that. That's not his decision. Shepard's admission into the Spectres is not the purpose of this meeting. This meeting has no purpose. Mm -hmm. The humans are wasting your time, Counselor, and mine. Saren's hiding behind his position as a Spectre. You need to open your eyes. What we need is evidence. So far, we've seen nothing. There is still one outstanding issue. Commander Shepard's vision. It may have been triggered by the beacon. Are we allowing dreams into evidence now? <laughs> How can I defend my innocence against this kind of testimony? I agree. Our judgment must be based on facts and evidence, not wild imaginings and reckless speculation. Do you have anything else to add, Commander Shepard? You've made your decision. I won't waste my breath. Mm. The Council has found no evidence of any connection between Saren and the Geth. Ambassador, your petition to have him disbarred from the Spectres is denied. I'm glad to see justice was served. Oh, -ho. This meeting is adjourned. What an asshole. Oh, good fucking villain, though, so far. Oh, let's be quite honest. He's like, he's my friend. Ha 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 ha. It was a mistake bringing you into that hearing, Captain. You and Saren have too much history. It made the Council question our motives. I know Saren. He's working with the Geth for one reason. To exterminate the entire human race. Every colony we have is at risk. Every world we control is in danger. Even Earth isn't safe. I didn't know Saren. Tell me about this history between you and Saren. I worked with him on a mission a long time ago. Things went bad. Real bad. 
We shouldn't talk about this here. But I know what he's like. And he has to be stopped. What's our next step? As a Spectre, he's virtually untouchable. We need to find some way to expose him. What about Garrus, that CSEC investigator? We saw him arguing with the Executor. That's right. He was asking for more time to finish his report. Seems like he was close to finding something on Saren. Any idea where we could find him? I have a contact in CSEC who can help us track Garrus down. His name is Harkin. Forget it. They suspended Harkin last month, drinking on the job. I won't waste my time with that loser. You won't have to. I don't want the Council using your past history with Saren as an excuse to ignore anything we turn up. Shepard will handle this. You can't just cut Captain Anderson out of this investigation. The Ambassador's right. I need to step aside. I need to take care of some business. Captain, meet me in my office later. Bye. Harkin's probably getting drunk at Cora's Den. It's a dingy little club in the lower section of the wards. Maybe there's another way to find evidence against Saren. You should talk to Barla Vaughn over in the financial district. Rumor has it he's an agent for the Shadow Broker. The Shadow Broker? An information dealer. Buys and sells secrets to the highest bidder. I've heard Barla Vaughn's one of the top representatives. He might know something about Saren. Mm. But his information won't come cheap. You and Saren have a history. What happened? About 20 years ago, I was part of a mission in the Skillian Verge. I was working with Saren to find and remove a known terrorist threat. Saren eliminated his target, but a lot of people died along the way, innocent people. And the official records just covered it all up. But I saw how he operates. No conscience, no hesitation. He'd kill a thousand innocent civilians to end a war without a second thought. He's a monster. Killing innocence doesn't end wars. It causes them. I know how the world works, Kurt. Sometimes you're forced to make unpleasant decisions. But only if there's no other way. Saren doesn't even look for another option. He's twisted, broken. He likes the violence, the killing. And he knows how to cover his tracks. Killing innocents doesn't end wars. It causes oh. them. I know how the world works, Kurt. Sometimes you're forced to make unpleasant decisions. But only if oh. there's no other way. Saren doesn't even look for another I didn't realize I was gonna get in the loop. Broken. He likes the violence, the killing. And he knows how to cover his tracks. I should go. Good luck, Shepard. I'll be over in the ambassador's office if you need anything else. Right, okay, so. Get more paragon at least, which is good. But like, what did I get? Some renegade or was renegade always there? So, so let's switch to Harkin. I see Balavon in the financial district. Where? Ah, see, I. It's don't get me wrong. Like places like this are really cool, big citadels and space. I just get very lost in them though. I'm not I'm not good at pathfinding, to be quite honest. That guy's Wait, come on. What? Oh no, I wasn't. Never mind. Um yes, is there something you want? Why are you so interested in the keepers? Keepers? I've got no interest in the keepers. Don't get coy. I know what I saw. I, uh... I'm not so sure I should be talking to you about this. We're just talking. Is there something wrong with that? No. I guess it wouldn't hurt to tell you. I'm using a small scanner to gather readings on the keepers. So far I've had mixed results. I find it difficult to get near the creatures. Why were you being so secretive about it, though? Well, technically we're not supposed to disturb the keepers. I don't really think my scanning disturbs them, but the authorities might disagree. I'd like to do it more openly, okay. but it's not really worth getting arrested over. I'll help. I can help you out. I'm not worried about the authorities. I don't even know who you are. I'm Commander Shepard with the Alliance Military. Hmm. Well, I, I suppose I could use the help. You'll need this. It's the scanning device I developed. Activate it each time you see a keeper. 
all collected data will automatically upload to my database. I'll even send a few credits your way for each unique scan. What are you doing? What are you doing with the data once you've scanned it? Trying to learn whatever I can about the keepers. We see them working everywhere, yet we know so little about them. I'm a scientist. I want to know what makes them tick. I should get going. Yeah. Yes, I have much work myself. So long, and good luck with the scanning. Weird. Okay. So scan the keepers when you see them. Sure. Shoo, 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 shoo. Sure. Okay. Cool. I will try to remember that. Stop getting your weapon out. Cool. Nice little stroll around the city. I forgot to play an ad break. During my actual break. Damn. I guess I'll do it later. I can't believe the council ignored all the evidence against him. Stern's one of the best officers the city has had in years. Oh, so now we just chase leads while this smug jury runs around with his gas papers. That's politics, Chief. I hate politics. Nice. Wait, I needed to. Greetings and welcome to the Presidium. My name is Avina, and I am pleased to be your virtual guide throughout this level of the Citadel Space Station. So, are you a person or a program? I am a fully interactive virtual intelligence program to provide spontaneous guidance at predetermined locations of interest throughout this level of the Citadel. I may also be contacted through any of the Presidium VI terminals, should you require assistance. Give me the tour. You are standing at Presidium Tourism Terminal 2, located at the base of the Citadel Tower, one of the most recognizable and important features of the Presidium. To your left is one of the Keepers, the enigmatic caretakers of the Citadel, working on a control panel. You may see Keepers involved in various tasks throughout all levels of the Citadel, we ask that you do not interfere with them in any way. The Keepers are essential to the smooth operation of the Citadel. Obstructing their daily work will result in harsh penalties, including incarceration and rehabilitation. Tell me about the Relay Monument. Discovered by the Asari who first arrived at the Citadel, the Relay Monument is one of the station's most interesting and controversial features. What is the meaning behind this striking piece of art? Is it a tribute to Prothean vanity? A reminder of their conquest of the galaxy through mass relay technology? Or perhaps it is a symbol of unity? A Prothean acknowledgement that the relays would eventually lead other species here to the Citadel? No one can say for sure, making the relay monument a favorite topic of discussion among academics and scholars. That's all for now. Thank you for using Arena. Yeah. Have a pleasant Oh, I actually got XP for doing that, okay. Cool. So... Okay. Stop getting your weapon out. Stop it! So, we need to go to the... F to learn of the Enkindlers? Or has the Honorable CSEC officer enlisted assistance? Why is the CSEC officer harassing you? The CSEC officer requests that this one purchase an evangelical permit to spread the truth of the Enkindlers. Okay. Let me talk to the CSEC officer. Perhaps I can explain the situation. This one would be most... That Hanar refuses to listen to reason. Why can't it act in an orderly and lawful manner? Uh, 
Be more reminded. should be more tolerant. It's just trying to express its beliefs. I am not unreasonable. The Hanar is free to spew its nonsense once it purchases an evangelical permit. So if the Hanar gets a permit, it's allowed to preach? No. Registered evangelicals must follow regulations. There are specific areas where preaching is legal. Failure to follow the regulations results in the forfeiture of the license. If you'd like, I could talk to the Hanar for you. I have argued with the stubborn jelly all afternoon. You are certainly welcome to try. Has the CSEC officer been assuaged? Mm. Is this really how you want to represent the Enkindlers? The truth of the Enkindlers must be made known. They gave the Hanar language and gave the universe the mass relays. This one only wishes to spread the truth to any who will listen. There is no intent to cause trouble. Can I buy a permit? What if I purchase the evangelical permit for you? Finances are only a partial limitation. This one does not believe that one should pay in order to speak the truth. However, this one also does not possess the 150 credits necessary to purchase the permit. Did you know? 150 credits. This should cover you. This is a most appreciated action. You are not of the Hanar, but you wish to help spread the truth of the Enkindlers. Okay. This one will not cause any further trouble for the CSEC officer. This one offers its thanks. So I lost 150 credits. Nice. What do you want? The Hanar is. Uh, let me get lunch. You want Thank you. Yeah, I told you what I want. You wasn't listening. Oh my <laughs> god. Be right back, guys. I need to go beat. I need to go beat him. I'll play an ad while I'm gone. Right, time to beat you, boy. He just popped to the shop to get some lunch, so we don't really have anything in. But he literally forgot why I asked him. Whatever. Happy to help. Here, for your assistance in this matter. Now, if you'll excuse me, I should report to my superiors. Okay. Nice. There's a keeper somewhere. Oh, there he is. Right. This bit dust or something. Nice. So basically, the whole thing was like um, lose 150 credits for a maybe gel. Did I get Paragon there? I didn't see, I wasn't paying attention. So I want. Financial. I'll just backtrack. I know I've seen the keepers up here. Uh, was it? Was there a keeper over here? I wonder if there's an achievement for scanning all the keepers. Stop getting your gun out. I don't think there were. No, no. Okay, so we're back where we started. So.
Stop! I keep hitting the uh, trigger by accident. Okay. It is very pretty though. I look at the water. Ah, that's the keeper I saw earlier. That's what I was trying to find. Alright, so I need to find... So this is the district, I think. I think this is how it works. Oh, hello, keeper. Wonder how many keepers there are in the Citadel. Huh. Huh, what? Emporium shopkeeper. Okay. Ah. Get stuck on people. Ah, here we go, Balavon. What's this? One of the Earth Clan. Ah, a very famous one, yes? You are the one called Shepherd. The tale of how you survived the great tragedy on Akuz is truly remarkable. I am amazed each time I hear it. Have we met? You've got me at a disadvantage here. Forgive me, Earth Clan. My name is Barla Vaughn. My job makes it necessary for me to keep informed. I am a financial advisor to many important clients here on the Citadel. When someone as important as yourself arrives on the station, I take notice. I need help. I've heard you work for the Shadow Broker. Do you have any information about Sarah? You're very blunt, Shepard. But you're right. I am an agent for the Shadow Broker. And I do know something about Sarah. Can I make a deal? I hear your information can be expensive. Normally, this information would cost a small fortune, but these are exceptional circumstances. So oh, I wow. am going to give it to you for free. What's the catch? There is no catch. The shadow broker is quite upset with Saren right now. They used to do a lot of business. Until Saren turned on him. Says him right. That's what happens when you deal with a traitor like Saren. No matter what you think of Saren, he's not stupid. He knows the Shadow Broker is a valuable ally. Turning on him doesn't make sense. Not unless something huge was at stake. I don't know the details, but the Shadow Broker hired a freelancer to deal with it. A Krogan mercenary. Oh, where is he? How do I find him? I heard he was paying Citadel Security a visit. If you hurry, you can probably catch him before he leaves the CSEC Academy. Thanks for the info. Nice. Oh, level up! Ah, uh, it's Rex. Yes. Alright, so for me. Me, 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 me. Almost there. Hmm. I like popping up the soldier. Uh, soldier. Maybe like some points in here. Oh, shocking. Okay. Mm. Mm, maybe just combat armor. Here we go. All right. So for you, let's just do assault rifles. Let's do soldier. Makes sense. For you, let's get those fucking damn electronics. Okay. Oh.
Wait, so why did we say Rex was again? I mean, we're pretty close to the Susac Academy, so maybe. Yeah. Let's go talk to Rex, and then we'll go talk to. Um, Garrus. I've already got you. Oh, I guess not. Oh yeah, whatever, whatever. Welcome, I am Melina. I don't recognize you as one of our expected clients today. Would you like me to see when the consort will be able to meet with you? I think I'm done here. Oh well, I hope you'll return again in the future. We always enjoy seeing new clients. Melina. Yes, Shaira. Send the commander up to see me. I wish to speak with him. Yes, of course, mistress. I don't know why I'm here. I didn't mean I didn't mean to come down here. Huh. I don't know what's going on. It appears the consort has taken notice of you. She'd like to meet with you now. If I have time, I'll speak with her. Well, don't wait too long. I wouldn't want you to miss this opportunity. She'll be waiting upstairs if you choose to go. I'm sorry, is this like prostitution? Just no thanks. Or escort. Could be an escort service, I suppose. Right, uh. B -b 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 there was a turn in for. C sec, wasn't there? For the academy? Yeah, there is. Oh, it's not down. Okay. Mm, okay. You said the academy, right? You said. I said the academy, right? Yeah. Uh, I know it's through there, but I'm just checking for a keeper. No, there is no keepers. Okay, to the academy. Attack on Eden Prime. Many colonial investors are pulling their support for future projects. Proponents of expanded human colonization insist that Eden Prime was an isolated case. Nevertheless, colonist enrollment has dropped sharply. Many colonial proposals are on hold until backers have some reassurance that human colonies will be adequately protected. Interesting. Cool. What is that? What is that? What is that weird square? Oh, hello. Commander Shepard, here with the Alliance Military. First time on the Citadel, that about right? How did you know all that? I'm the CSEC Requisitions Officer. I need to make sure our buyers are authorized. So, will you be purchasing anything today, Commander Shepard? Oh, okay, so it's a shell, basically. Excellent. I hope you find what you're looking for. Oh, uh, okay. We are not going to worry about that for now, uh, because we'll probably pick up a lot of stuff early on. But, uh, yeah. Ah, oh, here he is, look. Witnesses saw you making threats in Fist's bar. Stay away from him. I don't take orders from you. This is your only warning, Rex. You should warn Fist. I will kill him. <laughs> you want me to arrest you? I want you to try. 
<laughs> Go on. Get out of here. Yes, human. You can help me. I'm trying to bring down Sarah. Barlavon said to talk to you. Barlavon is a wise man. He may share a common goal, human. How so? Enlighten me. I've been hired to kill the owner of Korra's den, a man named Fist. He did something very foolish. Tell me. What did he do? He betrayed the Shadow Broker. A Quarian showed up here on the Citadel. He was on the run. He wanted to trade information for a safe place to hide, so she went to Fist. He promised to arrange a meeting between her and the Shadow Broker. Instead, he contacted Saren. Big mistake. It's not too smart. He's just greedy. Saren paid him a small fortune for the Quarian. He had to. She has evidence connecting him to the Geth. If we get our hands on that evidence, we can prove that Saren's a traitor. And the Council will have to listen to us. Where's the quarry in now? Last I heard, Fist still had her. Probably somewhere inside his club. If you help me kill Fist, she's all yours. Still. Time we paid Fist a visit. What about Garrus, that Turian? He wants to take Saren down too. Yeah, don't worry, Ashley. I'm going to be replacing you and Caden with Garrus and Rex. So don't, don't you worry about that. Don't worry. He might come in handy. He was here just before you showed up. Said he was going to follow up a lead on his investigation. Wanted to speak to the doctor at the med clinic. Move out. Yes. Yes. Yeah, fuck off, Ashley. Fuck off, Ashley. Oh, fuck off. You stupid bitch. Alright, so, um... What you got? Oh my god, he is just so he has warped. Oh, that's pretty good. Okay, so he's quite defensive actually. Okay, so I could make him my defense person. Um, Krogan Pathomaster, what does that give? <sighs> yep, health regen, physics, sci sorry, psychic resistance, and increased melee damage. Okay. Let's just max it out, fuck it. Uh, barrier... I'm not entirely sure what to give him, to be honest. I guess he would be a shotgun person, wouldn't he? So, I guess let's give him some. Um, oh, I can undo it. Okay, actually, wait. Let's do. I think let's do that instead. Mm, no, I don't like that. Do you know what? Yeah, let's yeah, let's do it, and then maybe give him combat armor for now. Yeah, I think that's fine. Cool whip. Right, so let's go. The med clinic in the upper wards. Okay. I'm gonna totally get lost. Is there a fast boy? There is a fast boy here. Give me the stuff. Is that all mine? Mm -hmm. Thanks. Uh, ward locations. What access?
Hmm. So why would the um the med clinic and the upper wards? If I come the wrong way, do I have you? Yes, can you already? Oh, here we go. I was right. A Solarian excavation team has run into an unexpected problem after unearthing a Prothean dig site. Hanar protesters have blockaded the dig site, claiming that artifacts of the Enkindlers, as the Hanar call them, should not be disturbed. The excavation team has appealed to Hanar representatives on the Citadel to reach a diplomatic solution. Aha. Uh -huh. I'm surprised you're willing to fight Crowley, I thought you'd stand with your own. Anyone who fights us is either stupid or on Saren's payroll. Killing the latter is business. Killing the former is a favor to the universe. Fair enough. Hmm. What is this place? Oh no, I don't want to be here. Sorry, I've just found a bone in my sandwich. Um, that's not good. I guess it happened though. That's what it is. Wow. I'm Emily Wong. I'm an investigative journalist working here on the Citadel. Could I have a moment of your time? What do you need? I've been hunting for evidence of corruption and organized crime on the Citadel, but there are places I can't go. I was hoping you might share anything you find during your own investigation. I can make it worth your time. Sounds like a okay. good cause. If I find any information, it's yours. Thank you, Commander. You won't regret it. Okay, so I 
I just want to pop my head through this door. I kind of pop my sandwich now, to be honest. That's fine that bone. I just want to see if there's like a keeper here. Yeah, there's one in the back. I see it. Yeah, it's me. Okay. So we want to go get Garrus. Abs 100% we want Garrus. Oh. No. Aha. Cool. 